Hello, Cancer. Getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on. You have the card of soulmate taking a leap of faith here and now. Okay. So you or your soulmate may be taking some sort of leap of faith right now. So what else is going on for Cancer? You have a message of change. Okay, you have an insight card and change card. All right. What is going on for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Page of Swords, the Empress, the Wheel of Fortune, Eight of Wands, there's the Messages, Ace of Coins, and the Seven of Swords. Interesting. Under the deck is the Five of Cups. All right. All right, so there is a message here about some sort of change. It could be because of a job someone's taking. Um, or it could be, could be other things, Empress. Someone may be pregnant. Somebody may be getting married. Uh, it could be because of family obligations. But it's interesting that the outcome here is the Seven of Swords. What is that about? So are they not telling the truth? Are they trying to, uh, you know, scare you? Someone is watching and they're worried, sad. Oh, no. Under the deck is the tower. So there is a message here from someone who's making some sort of change that they don't want to make. They possibly could have gotten someone pregnant, but they could be with somebody else, but they're not happy. You can see the messages, are they going out into the cold? Now this, so this is meaning they're going to tell you, obviously something, and it's going to look good, you know, in the text and the message is going to look like they're happy. They're not really that happy. Maybe they even lost an opportunity or something. Maybe they're walking away. The Empress could be you. Maybe they're walking away and losing a commitment with you. So when you get this message, something just flipped around. They have to make a choice. Could be you also have to make a choice. We'll see what shows up. But it flipped around. It's something that either you, you don't see or, and I'm noticing it's right with this Emperor energy as well. So what is going on here? What else is going on here? They're worried. The lover's energy, making a decision. Trying to work things. Okay. And the emperor is under here. So it really doesn't matter why they're leaving or why they're doing this change. The thing is they don't really want to. That's what's important to know. And I don't think that they're not gonna tell you they're tired, they're worn out, they're sad they may even have a party or something. I feel like you know this person's soul. I feel like some may even be retiring. Like maybe it's a retirement par party or something. But um, whatever it is, this person really is not revealing how they truly feel. They really don't want to walk away. It's taking all their strength to leave this connection when they really don't want to. And you are the only person, Cancer, I think that knows this. You know this person so well, and you know that they're not happy doing this. So what is this lover's energy of the world? The tower, five of swords going after what they want, manifesting, making this decision for some sort of new beginning with the message. So again, it's showing me clearly that whatever here is ending, if it's ending between the two of you, if they have to move, they're making some sort of big change here, they don't really want to. They're acting like everything's good. Now they may be honest with you in person possibly, but but if not, you're the only person who knows like this, this isn't what they want. They could be with a new person or another person. Maybe they don't want to be with that person is what I'm seeing here. So the reading's super clear. Right, let me see. What is the world? Oop, devil. So it could have been, it can be something that, um, you know, it's toxic, something. It might be a Capricorn or something they can't get out of. Now this looks like someone they're in a relationship with for them, like the money, like they're with someone who only wants them for their money. So they're very unhappy or they have to do something for money. So I might leap of faith right now. Manning up emperor, emperor energy. Okay, the world. Okay, this could be a dream come true as well. This could be something that was already planned years ago. You know, so it could be so many different thing, things. All I know is that this person is hiding true feelings of what they, um, what they really want it's not really what they're going after or if you can't be a part of that cancer um, they're very sad what would they say to you you were the whole package 
They say, they say, I don't understand these feelings I'm having. I feel like they can't face you. See, that's the thing. They're not telling you the truth. But I feel like they're trying to put it on a brave face. But please accept my apology. And this separation will soon be over. Hmm. What does Cancer need to know about this situation? What does Cancer need to know about this situation? Okay, the card is games. So this definitely could be someone who is playing a game, who's not telling the truth, who's telling you one thing, but they really feel a different way. They're hiding how they really, you know, feel about the situation. So if you want to call it a game, some of you, then yes, it's they're playing games. But um, and, or you may feel like this whole time this has been a game. So again, maybe when you get this message, you're like, because the card says, what about this was real? So like, was this all just a game? There's nothing, there was nothing here about me? No, there was love for you, Cancer. They really did love you. But whatever this other thing, it's like it was already in play. It's something like they have, I don't, I don't know, have to do. Or if they are with someone else, they married someone else, or someone else pregnant, or they went off. It's definitely clearly about money, status, maybe family. So... So I can see why they're saying I can't face you now. And you are the whole package. You were the whole package. I don't think they were expecting to feel this sad. Going through this um, separation. Okay, what else? So the messages you're going to get are about change in this connection. And your person, this person is going to be leaving to go do something else. But they really don't want to. And there I go, dropping more cards again dropping cards this past week i'm blaming retrograde okay two fell on the floor so oh no there's three here disappointment miscommunication and defenses healing healing sadness this may have been something that has already happened to some of you it's kind of getting because I feel like what you were asking about was, does this person, like, did they really love me when we were together? And I get, yes, they did. So there was love at the time, but I just can tell that you you know this person. You feel their soul or you know their soul and you understand, well, I don't know, I guess you understand them. You understand them, yes. You don't understand why they're doing this. Universe, what is the message for cancer? What is the message for cancer? Page of Wands, Three of Cups, the Sun. You will be with this person again. There will be some sort of celebration, the Nine of Wands. See how he can't face you, the Nine of Wands? And I'm getting for some of you also, if this is, if they are going toward a career move, something where they're going to, you know, emperor up, boss up, make more money, they know it's good for their long-term security and possibly for you too. You may be included in this down the way. Maybe this Nine of Coins is you down the way, like they are addicted to working, addicted to money, something like that. Um, so it could be something that again is work related, but you will be happy again or be with this person again or celebrating, or you may see this person at a celebration. If there's a going away party or some sort of party here, um, I feel like this person feels bad. See, cause I don't wanna tell you to wait for this person for this. Cause they do say that you will be together again. But I feel like there's going to be a long period for some of you maybe of not seeing them or not talking to them. And I wouldn't want you just to wait around for this person. But I know that they hurt your feelings. I know that they made you feel sad, Cancer. And there was love in this connection. It was not just all games. But as far as right now, you need to, I think, move forward and do something else. Do something different. Even though I know that's difficult. Now, what advice do you have for Cancer? What advice do you have for Cancer? They really don't want to leave you. This could be something again, like maybe they'll come back in a year after after the contract is over, or it could be less time than that. Seven of Swords, High Priestess. You do know. You know the secrets around this connection with this person. You know what they're really thinking and feeling, and I guess you can call them lies. They're putting on a brave face, acting like you know everything's fine. They're happy. They're happy to be leaving. They really don't want to. Ace of Swords, the truth. The communication and the five of swords. Five of coins. Yeah, they're out in the hole. I 
they're really they're really unhappy. They are really stressed. Page of Cups, Page of Coin, King of Swords, Strength card. Again, I feel like they put on a brave face in conversations. I don't feel like they're gonna tell you the truth though, to be honest. I really don't feel like they're going to break down and tell you how they're really feeling. Um, I feel like this is, the, the King of Swords with the Strength card is a hard nut to crack, whether it's a man or a woman, whatever sign. They're not gonna reveal anything to you at this time is what I'm getting. They are sad to go, but they I don't get they're gonna really express that. So what you need to know is that there was love there. there this wasn't just a game for them. And it is breaking their heart to leave you behind to go do this. So I'm going to leave it there, you guys. Have a great week. I'll talk to you soon.